But Dave, a good solid workout for the lads there, you know, another 90 minutes under the belt and we're a week out from the season now, it must be kind of buzzing now with the last weekend. Yeah, look, that's it, that's pre-season over with now. Um, it's been a mixed bag, it's been a lot of learning, a lot of positives, a lot of areas that we know we've still got to improve on. But listen, I'm ever so proud of these boys, young, hungry, energetic, they want to do well for this club. You know, and I've already said it, as you know, Nigel, we've, we've 19 players now all based in Donegal which is brilliant and we know for a fact that we've got fantastic fans and they're going to get right behind us. Yeah, and uh, look, as I said, we know the Sligo's one of the, the top Premier Division sides and we, we kind of put it up to them there over the 90 minutes tonight. Listen, if, if we're standing here now and you're asking me, you know, we've come off the pitch and we've not created anything, we've actually created three or four good opportunities where we could have, you know, on another night you might score a goal. But look, like I said, lots of positives. Still many, you know, many areas that we've got to improve on and the boys know that. And that's down to myself, Murph, Stephen and all the staff to keep driving home our principles. But I think anyone can see the style of football that we're trying to play. And we're not going to deviate away from that. We're on the front foot, we'll get after teams. And then, um, you know, we get one of the two lads back from who carry little niggles and uh, we have a good week ahead of us. Yeah, we have a couple of new lads in there again this week. You know, are you happy with where the squad is at at the minute? Absolutely. Look, you're always looking to try and strengthen. Um, and that, that'll never stop. But we're already at 19. Like I said, Nigel, we've got 19 players who are already committed to Donegal. You know, and, and I'll keep drumming home to these boys how special it means to play for Finn Harps. They know that, but they're learning, they're getting better. I mean, we had a, when we lost Big Keith, I think our back four, our oldest age was 18. Two 17-year-olds and 18-year-old. And young Ellis, who made his debut after coming from Stockport, thought he was absolutely outstanding. Real mature performance. Um, but look, look, lots of positives and we just keep working hard on them. Yeah, so obviously now we look forward to Galway next week. It's the, the first home game, you know, your first own competitive game in the managing Finn Harps. You know, that must be a real buzz now. Absolutely. Look, look, you can play as many pre-season games as you want, but now we're at the business end of things now. So we'll get back tonight, we'll recover, we'll go again on Monday. And um, yeah, Galway United the home, great game. Hopefully the fans will fill the park like we've been asking them to, and I'm sure they will. But look, we know what's ahead of us. It's a challenge, it's an exciting challenge, but it's one that we're ready to grasp. And like I said, again, we're not going to deviate from our style of play, our principles of play. Play forward, think forward, run forward. And, um, you know, we'll be OK, we'll get going and we're looking ahead.